All right, Shalom. I want to give all praises to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Rakakwadash, double honors to my apostles and elders of Great Millstone who rule well. Salutations to the Lord's whole four legs scattered abroad. All right, I'm the brother Taz of War. Back at you again with another lesson. And uh, Lord willing, I pray you're edified, all right, through the spirit and power of Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai. All right, and it's going to be another quick one. I was just uh, watching a few videos. And uh, this your boy Kwame Brown, all right, who made a you know a buzz months back, and um, here he uh, here he is again trending, you know, because he spoke about you know uh, men wearing dresses, and uh, he's he's right, okay, but this world we're living in, okay, which is here in Babylon the Great, you know, and that's what makes this place Babylon the Great, all right, the shit that. Jake is doing the, the shit that you know Esau is doing the agendas you know it wouldn't be Babylon the Great if he didn't do those things all right so all praises to Yahweh Bahashim Yahweh Shai you know your first emotion when seeing what little Nas X did uh, knowing that they titled his video a children's video all right and how ex exclusive and explicit his his content is and what he's doing you know they're pushing that on children you know uh, at first it makes you mad all right but then you know when you realize that this is Babylon the Great which is North America and the Lord is going to destroy it off the face of the earth you know you just calm down man, you know and give all praises to Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai man because if they wasn't doing this all right we wouldn't be close to our salvation we wouldn't be close to Jacob's kingdom all right because the scriptures tell us in second edge 6 that Esau is the end of the world and Jacob is up next that followeth so we at the end of Esau's kingdomship all right through his policies his democracy all right through his force of technology all right when he calls of all both small and great rich and poor to receive a mark all right which is that karagma you know right now you're dealing with the force of the Satan juice we at the end of his kingdom man now I'll lead a link to this video here that I saw from mag TV a clipping with on um, Kwame Brown actually speaking on it you know giving his little two cent and um, you know hey it's the truth man because you know he's speaking against wickedness all right what's going on that these devils are doing and having Jake um, participate and be sponsors for it you know, to push an agenda upon the blacks and Latinos, the Israelites, it's wicked as hell. All right. But what I want to do, you know, I want to read a scripture. Uh, this is Jude chapter one, verse seven. Even as Sodom and Gomorrah and the cities about them in like manner, giving themselves over to fornication and going after strange flesh are set forth for an example, suffering the vengeance of eternal fire. All right, so the Lord said, even as Sodom and Gomorrah and the cities about them in like manner, because when you go back to the history of Sodom and Gomorrah, that place was destroyed with fire and brimstone. All right, and there's no one that inhabit that land today. Okay, and the Lord have it here where he says, even as Sodom and Gomorrah and those cities, because there were cities banded about, those five cities, it says, and the cities about them in like manner, giving themselves over to fornication now the word fornication all right uh it really goes back to what adultery okay which is um un uh all unlawful sexual acts man all unlawful sex okay also you can you could commit spiritual fornication all right if you're an israelite and you're serving a, a false god that's you know physical fornication all right but the word fornication goes back to adultery you know all unlawful sex you know and you you name it it's going on today you know you got uh people edomites marrying animals man bestiality you name it you got the transformers the moles okay it says and going to going after strange flesh it's strange because that's not normal okay it says are set forth for an example so this place that the lord destroyed is set forth for an example it says suffering the vengeance of eternal fire and who belongs to the issue of death that's Yahweh Bahashim Yahweh Shai who vengeance belongs to Yahweh Bahashim Yahweh Shai 
So that place suffered the vengeance of the Lord, all right, of eternal fire, okay? And just like this place, which you call North America, is going to be destroyed with fire as well, all right? All right, Bible uh, prophecy, you know? We're not making this up. This is Bible prophecy. Now, this is Jude 1 and 8. Likewise, ye also filthy dreamers defile the flesh, despise dominion, and speak evil of dignities. So, you filthy dreamers defile the flesh, okay? You despise dominion and speak evil of dignities, you know? You could go into the Romans first chapter, you know, starting, I believe, at the 24th verse, or maybe a few verses up, and it goes all into that, you know, um, strange flesh, man. You know, so hopefully, I'm going to leave it with that. I hope this lesson was edified. You know, we got to praise Yahweh, Bashmi, I was shy, and continue to keep putting more prayers and those curses up upon the wicked, man, upon this place, this kingdom, you know, and pray that the Lord shorten the days for the elect's sake, you know, because, you know, getting all emotional and pissed off, it does do that, but you got to thank the Lord that he is doing that because this is bringing us closer to our kingdom here on earth. We're, we're, this is bringing us closer to the promises that was given to our forefathers, Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, all right? You know, Apostle Paul spoke about receiving those new bodies, all right? Rome, uh, Revelations, the 21st chapter, talks about a new heaven, a new earth. So we're getting closer and closer to that day. So I hope this lesson was edifying. I want to give all praises to Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai, Bahashem Rakakwadash. Double honors to my apostles and elders of Great Millstone who rule well. Salutations to the Lord's elect. Shalom.